Patriotic Prepper here. What's up, guys? So we're planning on having um, a giveaway, maybe right. once every week, once every 10 days or something. We're going to give away an item. Yeah. Some kind of a survival prepper. Can I win item. one? Yeah. Or it's can, just for them? It's just for them. Okay. You already have some. All right. But we want to do that to try to give back. And then also, I wanted to talk about our new flag. Check that out. We got a new flag. How do you like it? Second Amendment. Comment down below and tell us how you like it. Tell us where you're watching from. I'd like to know. Yeah. You know, what state or even if it's another country, wherever. I'd like to know where you guys are seeing our video from. Today, I want to talk a little bit about... I've been hearing in the last day or two people talk about, oh, the, the presidency, the, yeah. you know, the election's over, all the problems are over, so we don't need to worry about prepping anymore. Why do we even... You know, we're not going to need right. all this. It didn't blow up. And first of all, on our channel, that's not what we, I mean, yeah, we don't like that. And we were there through it. But that's not what prepping for us is about. No. no I mean, no. if that's all you cared about was an election, then yeah. go back to doing what you do. But that's the least of our problems. Yeah. And don't get me wrong. I'm with you on that whole election thing. I'm right there with y'all. I, I didn't like it. Don't like it. Don't have any, you know, the new administration's not for me. No. That has nothing to do with why we got into prepping. No, not at all. We got into prepping, one, because we were in Katrina. Yeah. Lost everything we owned. It really opened up our eyes big time. Yeah. yeah. And then we have a pandemic yeah. that... You know, it's killing people. I mean, there's just... The times right now are not the same as they used to be. Not even close. You know, Americans got lazy. They were able to just relax. Yeah. And myself included, when I was young, I didn't care anything about, uh, uh, you yeah. know, being prepared or making sure I had this or that when I was younger. Uh, I did what I wanted at that time. Right. Yeah. I lived for the minute, you know. and But then I have children. Yeah. I have a wife, I have a home. I wouldn't be a very good father, husband, owner yeah. if I didn't try to take care of them no matter what comes along. I mean, we still had riots out here What yesterday. Uh, but it's Antifa. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, and that was yesterday after Biden was already in. Yeah, yeah. Actually, so, they're starting to ramp up a little bit, aren't they? Yeah, from what I some heard. Some other states. Some other states. Biden and them aren't going to make them happy. Mm -hmm. So, you know, it, it it's not, from here out doesn't just mean everything's better and it's going to be great. And we're not the best prepper in the world. We're not telling you that we know no, everything. We're not claiming to be. No, we don't claim to be. We just claim that we tell you what we have and what we do and maybe it'll help somebody someday down the road. Yeah. That's our goal. We still have a lot of things to be prepared for. Just yeah. because the election's over, that. That's really not a... Uh, was a, lot. a lot of preppers were prepping a long time before that. Right. And will be a long time after. after. And don't get us wrong. The, it was a big deal. We're not putting sure. down how important it is or was. Because it's important. And yeah. it was important. But we don't need to just say, oh, everything's good now. We're just going to drop off and stop yeah, worrying about, about it. it. And I don't want you guys to do that either. Um and so hopefully this giveaway thing we're going to start doing. Yeah. And, you know, some new videos. We're going to try to do some more out, outdoor videos where we yeah, um, sure. show you how to do a little bit of stuff. It'll give a lot of people inspiration and, yeah. and give you something else to look at besides our mugs. Oh, here. boy. I wouldn't want to look at me. <laughs> but, uh, so anyway, that that's that's what we wanted to talk to you guys today about. It It is not time to stop being prepared because the election is over yeah. yeah it's just not if anything now it's time to push forward even harder yeah because we really have an uncertain future <laughs> <laughs> say and the least right sleep a little better at night knowing yeah that we might have some of it covered <laughs> sure you know we right. might not have everything we might not be the you know, we're not claiming that it's all, we're all safe. No, but no matter what comes our way or your way, if you're somewhat prepared, it's you can handle it. That's right. You we're know? we are a hell of a lot more prepared than a hell of a lot of people. It, don't start getting lax and thinking that you don't need to worry about it because 
the election had nothing to do with the pandemic no. when it hit no. us, right? No. And the, there's going to continue to be riots. There's going to continue to be unrest. No. And for sure. You know, and even without that, I mean, who knows what tomorrow brings. We, from us to you, that you keep prepping, keep doing what you're doing. Yeah. Don't let your guard down just because the election's over. Right. And we're saying this from our heart. We actually yeah. do care. That's right. why we have this channel. We're not making money off of it and all this type of stuff. We're doing this, like he said, to maybe help somebody, even if it touches one person. Exactly right. Yeah. So... With that, we're going to let y'all go. We'll have another video out for you guys tomorrow. Yeah, sure will. And um, we're getting some plans together. We'll let you guys know about the giveaway thing when we start that. Uh, stay prepared. Stay prepared. Stay don't, prepared. Don't get lax now. And it's not time to be lazy. Right. As he always said. Right. Don't get lazy. Lazy don't get you nowhere. That's right. <laughs> and other than that, have a good one. Thanks for being here. As always, God bless you.